in eukaryotes the rna polymerase 2 transcribes the dna the rna polymerase 2 has a ctd or c terminal domain or tail the ctd contains 52 tandem repeats each repeat has seven amino acid sequence and also each repeat has two serines one is at second position and other is at fifth position during late transcription initiation first of all the serine pipe of heptad repeat is phosphorylated the capping factors then bind to the serine 2 of heptad repeat present on the ctd as the rna polymerase transcribes the dna in the downstream direction an mrna begins to form this is the 5 prime end of mrna as the rna polymerase 2 continues transcription an mrna having 25 nucleotides is formed at this stage the capping factors bind to the 5 prime end of mrna the capping factors then form a 5 prime cap on mrna after the formation of 5 prime cap the capping factors are released the rna polymerase 2 is associated with a kinase as the rna polymerase 2 continues transcribing the kinase extensively phosphorylates the serine 2 amino acids on the ctd the splicing proteins then binds to the phosphorylated serine 2 and serine 5 of heptad repeat on the ctd as the rna polymerase 2 continues transcribing the dna in the downstream direction the bound splicing proteins are transferred to the emerging mrna the serine pipe amino acids of heptad repeat on the ctd is then dephosphorylated to this dephosphorylated serine pipe on the moving rna polymerase 2 the 3 prime and processing proteins bind the 3 prime and processing proteins act on the newly synthesized mrna as it emerges from the rna polymerase 2 all rna processing enzyme do not travel with the rna polymerase 2 please like subscribe and share